Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. In this video, we are going to solve one challenging rational equation problem. It is x square minus 4x over x square plus 4 plus 3 times x square minus 4 over x power 4 minus 16 equal to 3 times x minus 4 whole square over x power 4 minus 16. We have to find out all real solutions. So let's get started. I will begin with one algebraic identity x power 4 minus 16 we can write it is x square whole square minus 4 whole square a square minus b square difference of two squares so i can write a plus b times a minus b so we can write here x square plus 4 times x square minus 4 for real solutions x cannot be equal to plus minus 2 denominator cannot be 0. Now I will replace this denominator by x square plus 4 x square minus 4. So we can write equation as x square minus 4x over x square plus 4 plus 3 times x square minus 4 divided by x square plus 4 times x square minus 4 and right hand side it would be 3 times x minus 4 whole square divided by x power 4 minus 16 as it is. Now we can cancel these two brackets. Now our denominators in LHS are same. So we can simply add the numerators. So let us add, I will write x square minus 4x plus 3 divided by x square plus 4 equal to 3 times x minus 4 whole square divided by x power 4 minus 16. So I can write x square plus 4 x square minus 4. Now I can cancel these two denominators as it is non-zero. For real solutions, it cannot be zero. Now left hand side we have only x square minus 4x plus 3. And right hand side now we have 3 times x minus 4 whole square divided by x square minus 4. x cannot be equal to plus minus 2. So let's cross multiply. So I will write x square minus 4x plus 3 times x square minus 4 equal to 3 times x minus 4 whole square. Let's write x square minus 4x plus 3 times x square minus 4 equal to 3 times x minus 4 whole square. Now I will apply the difference of two squares here and I will factorize this bracket. So I can write after factorization it will be x minus 1 this bracket only times x minus 3 and here the difference of two squares so we can write x plus 2 times x minus 2. Right hand side is 3 times x minus 4 whole square. Now I will use substitution. Let us consider x minus 4 equal to suppose t. Once x minus 4 is t, its meaning is x is equal to t plus 4. Now we have to find out what will be the value of x minus 1? It will be t plus 3. Value of x minus 3? It will be t plus 1. Then I will write the value of x plus 2. This will be t plus 6. And similarly I will write x minus 2. This value will be t plus 2. Let us put the value. So I will write x minus 1, 
in that place i need to write let me write here t plus 3 x minus 3 t plus 1 x plus 2 t plus 6 x minus 2 t plus 2 right hand side is 3 times our substitution so i will be writing 3 times t square now i will club two brackets all together t plus 3 and t plus 2 all together so first and last bracket will consider t plus 3 times t plus 2 then we'll be writing t plus 1 t plus 6 rhs is 3t square as it is now i will multiply so it will become t square plus 3t plus 2t it will be 5t 3 times 2 6 one bracket is done second bracket t square 6t plus t 70 1 times 6 6 equal to 3t square remember our substitution is x minus 4 equal to t we will put it at last now i will consider a little manipulation step so i will write another time t square plus 5t plus 6 then t square plus 70 plus 6 right hand side is 3 times t square now i will write this t square plus 6t plus 6 and because of extra t so i have to write minus t similarly in the second bracket t square plus 6t plus 6 so plus t right hand side is 3t square now a plus b a minus b is written over there see this is a this is b so a minus b bracket a this is b a plus b bracket so i will be writing difference of two squares a square minus b square 60 plus 6 whole square minus b square so minus t square right hand side is 3t square take all the term to lhs so i will be writing t square plus 6t plus 6 whole square minus 4t square equal to 0 so t square plus 6t plus 6 whole square this is 2t whole square equal to 0 again we have to apply difference of two squares so i will write a plus b consider this is a this is b so once i will write a plus b bracket then it will become t square plus 8t plus 6 and when i will be writing a minus b bracket then it will become t square plus 40 60 minus 2t 40 plus 6 right hand side is 0 factorization is done now we have to put both the brackets 0 let me write here t square plus 8t plus 6 equal to 0 and second bracket is t square plus 40 plus 6 equal to 0 now let us apply quadratic formula for both the quadratic equations so i will be writing here t equal to minus b so minus 8 plus minus under the root b square so 64 minus 4 ac so 24 divided by 2a so 2 minus 8 plus minus square root 40 divided by 2 minus 8 plus minus 10 fours are so 2 root 10 divided by 2 or we can write minus 4 plus minus root 10 this is our t and t was our substitution it was x minus 4 
so let us find out t equal to minus 4 plus minus square root 10 substitution was x minus 4 equal to minus 4 plus minus square root 10 we can cancel minus 4 from both sides so x will be equal to plus minus root 10 two real solutions we will cross check verify at last now let us consider this second quadratic equation from first equation we have got two real solutions let's consider the second one t square plus 40 plus 6 equal to 0 so i can see if i will calculate only discriminant it is b square minus 4 ac value so i will write here 4 is square minus 4 times 1 times 6 16 minus 24 this is nothing but negative value negative 8 so i will write here complex solutions will generate so we will reject this let us consider our solution which was x is equal to plus minus root 10 so let me write here we will verify this solution also let's verify check i will write x is equal to plus minus root 10 okay let us consider lhs x is plus minus root 10 so our x square will be 10 only so let me write here 10 minus 4 if i will consider plus and minus then i need to consider here minus and plus so i will be writing minus plus 4 root 10 divided by 10 plus 4 14 plus 3 times x square is 10 10 minus 4 so i will be writing 6 divided by x power 4 100 minus 16 84 so i can cancel 3 and 84 by writing 28 then i can cancel by 2 so it will be common denominator 14 now it is left 10 minus plus 4 root 10 plus 3 so let me write here 13 minus plus 4 root 10 over 14 this is our lhs now see what will come out for rhs 3 times x minus so i will write here plus and minus root 10 minus 4 whole square divided by it is same 84 now i can cancel 3 and 84 by writing 28 now if plus sign is there then 2ab will be negative if minus sign is there then it will be positive so i will write here a square plus b square unchanged and once it is plus sign then minus sign will be there if it is minus then plus so i will write 8 root 10 over 28 now you can see if i will divide numerator denominator i will get same value 13 minus plus 4 root 10 divided by 14 because of lhs equal to rhs we can say this is our true and correct verified solution and this brings the end of this video i hope you will like this video thank you so much for watching do not forget to like share and subscribe bye bye till next video friends good luck take care of yourself bye bye